Rest in peace, Rue Wheatley. But now fucking GLaDOS is back. Fucking. Oh, wow. Welcome to Chapter 2, dude. Hey, guys. Sorry what? about the mess. Ooh. I've really let the place go since you killed me. By the way, <laughs> thanks for that. Sarcasm self-test complete. Oh, good. That's back online. I'll start getting everything else working while you perform this first simple test, which involves deadly lasers and how test subjects react when locked in a room with deadly lasers. Fuck, dude. Hey, guys. And welcome back to Dark Circle 22. Please. Portal 2. Thermal discouragement beam. Oh, God. It looks like she upgraded... St oh, I mean, whoever was... It looks different from the first game. Oh, God. Do you want me to fire something, or what are you doing? Okay. Oh, we gotta replace it. Put the better beam on there, I guess. Oh, shit! Um... What am I even trying to... Oh, I gotcha. I gotcha. Not bad. I forgot how good you are at this. You should pace yourself, though. We have a lot of tests to do. Holy shit, a giant one? Oh, smokes. Now it's starting to feel like Portal. Funny how this thing lasts this long. This next test involves discouragement redirection cubes. I just finished building them before you had your, well, episode. So now we'll both get to see how they work. There should be one in the corner. Discouragement cube? Oh god. Blah! Damn, this place fucking looks terrible. Oh, that thing. Oh! Hey, he's still okay. <laughs> that then? Oh, to deploy another one. Okay, I don't need another one. I'M GONNA THROW UP! Alright. Uh, is this gonna fuck me up as soon as I... Oh, where I'm facing. I see. I see. Damn, this place. Nothing's calibrated, dude. Oh god, I need the cube. Well done. Here come the test results. You are a horrible person. <laughs> That's what it says. A horrible person. We weren't even testing for that. Damn it, I wanted to bring it with me. Okay, 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 okay. Yeah, fuck it. I am a horrible person. She clearly hates me, dude. At least we're back to doing the test. That's what makes Don't portal. Let that horrible person thing discourage oh. <laughs> It's just a data point. If it makes you feel any better. Science has now validated your birth mother's decision to abandon you on a doorstep. Oh yeah, that's what happened? Is that real? Is that canon? Oh, the laser thing and then the discouragement cube. There's that. Oh god. I, uh... What the f... I, I thought I saw something, but whatever. It's, it's probably Wheatley looking around. He's still alive, apparently. Um. No. 
What's this? Dude! It reminds me of the aviator where he just fucking pisses in jars. He ate a lot of beans. Most people emerge from suspension terribly undernourished. I want to congratulate you on beating the odds and somehow managing to pack on a few pounds. <laughs> She's calling me fat. <laughs> I even made an indent on the bed. Oh god. She's hating on me, dude. I get it. She was reliving her death two minutes every fucking for I don't know how long it's been. So when she was in suspended animation up there, she was just reliving her death over and over and over again. So that's why I quick saved. It save stated her thing. I did kill her, but it one saves. moment. You are navigating these test chambers faster than I can build them. So feel free to slow down and do whatever it is you do when you're not destroying this facility. <laughs> Holy shit, she's like building it right here and then, dude. This thing's gonna kill me, isn't it? Uh, god damn it. Um. I see. Uh, I have to carry it. over there blue here and then blue there orange and then I go right and then when I hit blue it should do the oh god it's killing me no I did it wrong I did it wrong I'm an idiot okay so blue here so I should shoot orange at it damn it I'm an idiot okay now this shouldn't kill me there we go it went without me though I should have waited oh I killed the thingy oh god oh god how do I do this what do I do now how do I get that oh my god I was supposed to be on it I was supposed to be on it. Uh, can I jump on this? Uh, how do I... How do I get to there? Uh, oh, click it again. Oh my god. Okay, okay. So, now I'll shoot blue. Fuck me, I'm an idiot. I am the idiot! I am the one- Okay, don't use orange. I am the one, the one who does- There we go. There we go, we got it! 
I am a dumb. I am a dumb. Now we're thinking with portals. Don't get fucked up! I can't see! I'll give you credit. I guess you are listening to me. But for the record, you don't have to go that slowly. Ah, she's doing her mind games again. I know you're not, I know you're just pretending. You're just trying to make me feel bad. Just because I killed you and you were in there. Nine hundred nine 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 months. <laughs> her. I don't know how long it's been in. What's this? Cube. Where's the intro with the name? No name? It just shows the cube. Oh, look how many there are. Oh, oh, it just fucking took them all out. I missed it. This next test involves the Aperture Science Aerial Faith Plate. It was part of an initiative to investigate how well test subjects could solve problems when they were catapulted into space. Results were highly informative. Everything they could is not falling apart, dude. What is this? Oh. Oh my god, it can do stuff. I see. What's up with the music? Too Here's an interesting too fact. You're not breathing real air. It's too expensive to pump this far down. <laughs> we just take carbon dioxide out of a room, freshen it up a little, and pump it back in. So you'll be breathing the same room full of air for the rest of your life. I thought that was interesting. How about that? Catch me outside. How about that? How about that? I saw it like open. I saw f trees. Oh wait, that's like we're going further and further down. I see. I see what she means. I Let's see what, see what the means. next test is. Oh, advanced aerial faith plates. Well, have fun soaring through the air without a care in the world. I have to go to the wing that was made entirely of glass and pick up 15 acres of broken glass by myself. I like her voice so much. Oh, why, well, thank you. I like your voice so much. Everything is coming apart. Repair the broken glass everywhere. Oh, God. Oh my god, the swamp water! No! I see, dude. I see. I see, dude. Where should I prep? That way? Yeah, right? Yeah, right? Like that? Yeah, right? Oh god! Oh wow. At least it looks clean down here a little bit. What what what's gonna drop? Oh sorry. I'm still cleaning out the test chambers. So sometimes there's still trash in them. Standing around, smelling and being useless. Try to avoid the garbage hurtling towards you. I wanna see what is going on. What is this? You don't have to test with the garbage. It's garbage. Press the button again. Dun, 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 dun. Yeah, that one's not garbage, dude. Stand up, you piece of shit. There you go. Oh, this is disc is this? Holy shit! That's not water. Hey, what's what's all that? What is in there? There's a chair. Like 
God damn, water jug, rat man be drinking and stuff. He be drinking. The one that rat man be drinking. What am I doing? Uh. Oh God, my bad. trying to make me do? I see, I see. Oh, fuck me. Yeah. Remember before when I was talking about smelly garbage standing around being useless? That was a metaphor. I was actually talking about you. And I'm sorry. You didn't react at the time, so I was worried it sailed right <laughs> over your head. Which would have made this apology seem insane. That's why I had to call you garbage a second time just now. <laughs> Ooh, that's an aperture lab stand. I don't want to kill that guy, so I just let him live over there. He's just going to be guarding it broken over there. <laughs> Instead of getting completely destroyed by the fucking aura beam thingy. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. No, I need to, should have did an ear rape. Did you know that people with guilty consciences are more easily startled by loud noises? I'm sorry. I don't know why that went off. Anyway, just an interesting science fact. Fucking the subtitle at least prepped me for it. What are you trying to make me do? Oh, my companion! Oh. Did I accidentally fizzle that before you could complete the test? I'm sorry. Go ahead and grab another one. Bitch. Oh, no. I fizzled that one too. Oh well. We have warehouses full of the things. Absolutely worthless. I'm happy to get rid of them. What am I supposed to do with this? Oh, okay. I was about to say. Every test chamber is equipped with an emancipation grill at its exit, so that test subjects cannot smuggle test objects out of the test area. This one is broken. Don't take anything with you. I mean, there's nothing I can take. I think that one was about to say, I love you. 
They are sentient, of course. We just have a lot of them. She did that on purpose. You bitch. You bitch. There's that field thingy, I see. This next test involves emancipation grills. Remember, I told you about them in the last test area that did not have one. Oh no, the turbines again. I have to go. Wait, this next test does require some explanation. Let me give you the fast version. There, if you have any questions, just remember what I said in slow motion. Test on your own recognizance. I'll be right back. I got you, you bitch. That was it. <coughs> easy peasy, dude. Easy peasy. What's wrong with the turbines? Cash withdrawal. <laughs> Fuck! Alright, Dexter. JR wanted me to give you a little shout out. He says to call you a bastard, but I've never met you. You might be perfectly nice for all I know, you bastard. Like, comment, and subscribe, or I'll break your fucking legs.